What's up guys, Ryan Pineda with Pineda Health. So today I'm making martinis, and these martinis are actually good for you. So this could be a good alternative to, if you're the type of person that might have a drink after they get off of work to kind of wind down, get a little stress relief, or even before a night on the town. Uh, again, this could be a good alternative to that. You're still gonna get the same type of relaxation and calming effects that alcohol can give you but without the, uh, without the alcohol. The main ingredient in this martini is reishi. Reishi is known for helping with anxiety, uh, can also help calm your nerves and help you relax. Uh, another good thing is it's really good for your immune system. So all you really need is a, uh, a martini shaker. If you don't have that, you can also use any kind of protein shaker. Just make sure it's a small enough hole so the ice doesn't go into the glass. Uh, so first, of course, you need ice. I'm putting about a teaspoon of reishi. I get the powder online. You can also get it at any health food store. Um, you just want the, the fine powder. Uh, next ingredient is that I'm doing about a half a teaspoon of cacao powder, which is what chocolate is, comes from. So this is gonna be more of a chocolate-based martini, so you need the cacao to give it that chocolate flavor. It makes it taste really good. Ch cacao also really goes really well with reishi. They kind of have a good uh, synergistic effect. Uh, next, we need some, any kind of milk you could do. I do I'm doing coconut milk. But you can also do like almond milk or hemp milk, um, any milk that you know that you like. I put in about three ounces of coconut milk. Next, to sweeten it up a little bit, I'm using a liquid stevia. This is an organic stevia. It's a really good one from Amica. Amica is the brand, and it's a has a vanilla flavor to it too, so it'll give it a, a little bit of a vanilla kick to it. And stevia is much better than adding sugar or, or any other kind of uh, sugar-based sweetener. Stevia doesn't raise your, your insulin levels, so it's good for uh, if you're trying to lose weight. You don't want to be adding any kind of refined sugars to your, to your beverages or coffees or teas, anything like that. And that's it for the ingredients. Next, you just want to shake it up. So you put that in there, shake it really good. You want to get all that powder dissolved into the milk and then strain the ice out into your martini glass. And this is really good if you like the chocolate type martinis. Like a really popular drink is a, a vodka or espresso martini because you get the chocolate and the vanilla. So it'll remind you of that. And last, I'll just, this is optional. I just put a dash of cinnamon just cause I like cinnamon. And that's it, pretty simple. That's what it looks like. Nice and pretty. And again, this is a good alternative to, uh, you know, you stress out, long day at work, instead of grabbing a beer or a glass of wine, try this instead. You make you definitely feel a lot better the next day. You won't get any kind of hangover and it actually tastes really good. The added bonus again is it's, uh, it's actually beneficial for your immune system. So I hope you liked the video. Please like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.